to be able to be in a film which is so athletic and kind of, was there any, because both of you have done fighting stuff before, mm -hmm. was there anything new to this one that was kind of adding to your repertoire of of, of kick-ass? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, my character was ambidextrous, so, you know. <laughs> That's a, which is always good. <laughs> it's always good, so, you know, I, I, I had a lot, of, a lot of time learning to how practice, to yeah. practice how to use um, all my limbs. <laughs> Um, but uh, no, you know, we had a lot of fun making this film. It's a, it's a fun film. And, and you was there, because I've decided to call all female fighting now the Maggie Q down. I mean, like, it's oh, just going to be... Oh, is that not sweet? It, cool. Yeah, it's, it's like you're going to be a burb now. I'm just going to, I'm just going <laughs> to, like, I'm just going to just, just do that next time. And, and so I'm just wondering, is there anything new that you tried here that was kind of like... Um, yeah, no, absolutely. Yeah. No, you know, it's so funny because, you know, I do these interviews and these people, they, they lump the action genre together and just say, so, oh, you've done action, so, you know, this must have been nothing new, which is kind of ridiculous when yeah. you think about it because every action film is different, obviously. It's like a dance each time. So yeah, it's not like I've done action, so I've, you know, sort of raised the pole, you know, put up the pole, raised the flag and surrendered to it and just, you know, think I know everything. I, I mean, I absolutely don't. I, every film to the next is a challenge for me. And this one, again, was different action, different wire work, uh, motorcycles, which I don't do much, which was very challenging. So um, I think you learn, I mean, with every experience, it, it, it allows you, I mean, it should allow you to grow in, in a different way. The good thing about this is like, it almost sets the tone for maybe sequels and all this other kind of does, stuff. So yeah. was that ever part of a conversation of maybe what would happen if, and if so, how would you guys be involved? Well, you know, um, we're just at the point where we're, uh, you know, we're, we're releasing this this first film that, that we're really proud of and we hope, you know, audiences embrace it and enjoy watching it and have as much much fun with it as we did. But yes, yeah, certainly if, if, if that does happen, I think we'd all love to come back and make another one because we just had such a great time. The coolness yeah. about this is that, you know, you've got, it's very genre, but at the same time, there, I love the element of Western in this. And that, yes. that was kind of the coolness. And I was like, oh, this seems like a Western. So I was, I don't know, was that kind of always presented to you that this is going to be a bit of a futuristic Western? Yeah, well, I mean, you know, in, in early meetings that I had with Scott, he was very clear in, in outlining his vision for the film. and. You know, he would use references that, that I understood, like, you know, from Ridley Scott's Blade Runner to The Searchers, um, to Sergio Leone Westerns. And, um, and, you know, you watch the film and it's all there. It's an amazing eclectic, eclectic mix of genre and it works. Uh, Maggie, you know, we, we, are, we now see you a lot on television. And yeah. So are there any plans for you to come back to Asia and maybe do another Wuxia type movie or, or Yeah, I'm always talking to different filmmakers in Asia, you know, whenever there's something, you know, sort of fun and interesting that, you know, we want to do together. And I have, since I left, been back twice. I've made two films since I since I left, and um, you know, it always has to be sort of that, you know, when I came to the States, I started over, you know, I started from nothing again. And so, um, you know, I've been here now almost as long as I was in Asia, so it took a lot of time and concentration to actually, you know, get to a certain level here, which I'm, uh, of course, still <laughs> still trying to do. And um, so so when I do have time, and it is something that I'm very passionate about, I absolutely will go back. Well, and your fans in Asia look forward to you coming back. And Thank you so much. <laughs>